looks like we're gonna be getting some Vegas beat today. <laughs> I'm ready, excited, nervous, but we'll see. <laughs> Alright guys, so for today's video, we are going to be reacting to episode 11 of Kin Porsche the series. So in the last episode, things basically went down. We saw how it was revealed that Tawan has been working with Vegas the entire time. And then in the middle of all of that, we also saw that Pete was kidnapped. And now we're going to be seeing him getting tortured by Mr. Vegas. Still thinking about the fact that literally Kin freaking forgot about Pete. Really, Kin? So, without further ado, let's get right into the reaction of episode 11 of Kin Porsche the series. Yeah. Ah, okay. We're starting off right away. I can just. He's gonna kill you with this love. <laughs> Sorry, too soon. <laughs> I've been seeing people say online that Vegas is someone who gets pleasure from hurting people and then Pete is someone who, as I've heard, gets pleasure from when he gets hurt, so... They all seem to be perfect for each other then. <laughs> Get all that. Oh, Vegas! Ah, there's the tattoo oh, people have been talking so about. Honestly, well, in this universe, honesty seems to be very rare, you know? Oh, Okay, the look of Vegas seems to have changed already when his dad came in. Uh, what about Pete? <laughs> uh, he's right there. So Vegas is gonna have to go away for a bit. Okay. So how are we feeling, Vegas, after all of that? How are you still smiling through this, Pete? How are you still smiling through this? Yeah. You know what, the fact that they're literally in a red room right now and then combine that with the personality of Vegas. This scene is very moody. I'm not sure what the word is. <laughs> what are you planning, Vegas? What are you planning? Having fun, Vegas. Are you having fun? I'm sure you are. I'm sure these two are having fun. Ugh, Porsche, you have some nice pillows over there. <laughs> Mr. Kin, everything is settled now. May I see my... Oh my gosh. Yeah, kid, now are you remembering what you forgot? Yeah, you yeah, you did, Kim. You totally forgot about Pete. Porsche must be so freaking comfortable right now. <laughs> How to be you, Porsche? <laughs> Kim, if only you knew the full truth. You could have at least checked up on him. Oh no, he's going that far, <laughs> Vegas. Oh no, when he's crossing the line to family lines? No, 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 no. Oh no, Vegas. No, 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 no. Vegas, you monster. <laughs> Vegas. Uh, if he did try to get help, I feel like Vegas would have really killed him on the spot. I am disgusted. Vegas. Vegas. I can just feel the pain that Pete is going through. I can just feel the pain. Uh, <laughs> Vegas. I have no idea what else to say during this episode right oh now, God. so I'll just say props to Bible and build for their acting skills because right now I'm believing them so hard right now. Oh, you have more up your oh, sleeve, yeah, eh, Vegas? Everyone. Great, you're gonna have a companion now. Oh, oh wow, pet, that's what you want to call him, eh? Okay. Don't fall for Vegas, don't fall for Vegas, don't fall for Vegas. Stop it. Get some help. I mean, let's, if Vegas called me a good boy. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Hello? No, she's gonna tell him. Why am I gonna give props to Vegas? Props to Vegas because he called the grandma because he felt like Kin could have called her. Oh uh, no, he's not. He's not at that home. He's with this other home. Am I calling Vegas Pete's home right now? No, no, no. Actually, Kin. Porsche, I don't know, actually, Kin, please do think too much. <laughs> Who styled you, Tangon? I love your stylist for giving you these outfits. What? No. No. Kin, are you going to tell them? <gasps> oh. I <laughs> Did your mood just change when he said that? <laughs> what is this? A goodbye party? They had to f had everyone fall in love. 
<laughs> my guts are <laughs> <Po. laughs> <laughs> Is the gun necessary? <laughs> so, Father, did we get your approval? <laughs> same. Arm and ball, same. <laughs> oh no, here we go again. I remember that conversation that you and Kin had in... I forgot what episode. What? <laughs> <laughs> we weren't listening in, sir. I'm so sorry. We weren't listening in. <laughs> so, new residency. Okay. If poor Shay also stays there, that's gonna give Kim possibly another reason to stay. Okay, this place is so nice. Oh, uh, yeah, sure he does. He very much does have someone to keep him company. Speaking of which, where is he? <laughs> I'm just thinking way too ahead now as to what could happen between the two of them, so remember, <laughs> any minors watching, please turn away. <laughs> so where is P? Where is he? Ah, there is a whole lot of feelings going through in this room right now, what I'm seeing, um... Yes sir, I will eat it all. <laughs> Stop it. Get some help. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Someone stop me. Okay. So, poor shit you up. If he's not gonna be your bodyguard, he has other options for you. All right, there's this part that Kim, Kim was trying to find. Oh, why did I just remember that Big is dead? Big! Did Big ever find out who the driver is before he died? Hi, Porsche. Uh, how are you? I know you were really pissed at uh, Pores last episode. Yeah, why am I blanking out? Yeah, you were the reason why he wanted to get a job like this. <laughs> oh, Porsche. Porsche. I get that he was worried. There, there was that. I get him. I swear, their brother relationship, I just want to protect. Even more than Porsche wants to protect Porsche. <laughs> Yes, I will 100% yes. Porsche, would you be okay with that? <laughs> Must protect both of them, honestly. Must protect. Meanwhile, you really want to give us a wholesome moment and then go back to this? <laughs> really, Kim Porsche? Really? As I said earlier, there is a different uh thing of. Vegas that comes out when, when he was talking to his dad. <sighs> okay, everyone breathe. <laughs> Get a breather before every, anything happens. Oh, oh here all. we go. Here we go. Oh, shoot. He's actually bleeding right now. Oh, gosh. Ooh. You know what? All that training you have done working for the main family, it's paying off. Even if he does manage to get out of the house, where is he going to go? Where even is this safe house? Okay, yeah, in actuality, yeah, Pete, what is next? What are you going to do now? Where can you go? Meanwhile... We really want to go back and forth between Pete getting tortured to their sweetness, really. I feel like this episode is almost like, you may be uncomfortable with Pete, whatever Pete and Vegas are going through, so we'll lighten the load with this. <laughs> You've done that many times now, Porsche. You've done that many times now. True, actually. That's very true. Sweet new man. My guess. I'm sweet new man. I'm just jealous. <laughs> Good for you. Whatever. Fine. Let's just. Whatever. <laughs> The way he just went right back to hugging Porsche when he was woken up. Eh? Go. I'm sorry, what? Are we just gonna glance over that? The slavery part? Oh, so, no, Porsche is smoking again. I thought he was gonna quit. Hey, mother in law. Hey. Go on, say it. Oh. <laughs> 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 
Ang sweet nyo naman. Ang sweet nyo naman. Oh, shut up. Oh, shut up. <laughs> so, going back to, um, yeah, Vegas Pete. Oh, gosh, my life went out. He actually looks scared of his dad. Wait a minute, why am I starting to feel bad for Vegas? Hold on, why am I starting to feel bad? <laughs> Hold on. <gasps> Sir! Hold on! Now that's a whole nother thing when you actually get like disowned, you know? You know, I've seen the interview where Build was saying how much he wanted to punch Vegas at first and then he wanted to hug him. Yeah, I kinda see why now. No, 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 no. He's passed out because you tased him. He's just passed out. He's not dead. He's not dead. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We can't just leave that. No. Oh, I love your jacket. What the heck? Porsche, you're so precious. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you know what, Porsche? You can hang out with these three. These three I can trust in this family. Yeah, you know what? I can feel relaxed, kind of relaxed when I'm with you. With you. <gasps> He's gonna find out that Kim is their brother. Oh gosh. <gasps> yeah, Kim is also part of this. <laughs> Porsche, you have to find out this too. Yeah, well, yeah, he was knocked out when that happened, so he didn't even know. He had to find out about Porsche in the last episode, and he's finding about Kim in this one. Meanwhile, why? Why are we going back to? Okay, fine. Just don't matter the back and forth. Okay, you bandaged it. Ba bandaged him up. Not bondage. Not yet. We're not at that point. So we're taking a turn already, eh? Now that you saw that he was passed out, we're actually taking care of him now. <gasps> Well, that's a way to give him the pill. That's a way to give it to him. We are getting so soft right now. The music is just adding to it now. He might be your dad, but he ain't your daddy, as Guardians from the Galaxy 2 said. Oh god, I'm really feeling bad for Vegas. <laughs> Clearly, his dad doesn't agree. He... Oh my gosh, we're both opening up right now. Oh shoot! They do it because they couldn't do it themselves. Oh wow, we love passing the what's the word on to our children. Hey, you started it. You're the one who started opening up. Hi Kim. So uh by the way. Yeah, he knows now. Uh, cat's out of the bag. No, 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 no. Kim, you are not just walking away from this. Please be honest. I can't take this pain now with Porsche. I can't take it now. Oh my god. Meanwhile. Why are we going? You know what, Kim Porsche, you do this a lot, you know? <laughs> the fact that we get, like, a very scary or a very sad or emotional moment. You think that we can just suddenly feel better whenever we just see you, sweetness? I'm still not over with Porsche, what happened with Porsche. I'm still not over it. As sweet as you two are. Good for you. <laughs> Is it his birthday yet? Is this your birthday present? Meanwhile... Okay, we're back to this again. <laughs> We are going back and forth with everything right now. Oh, Vegas. Oh my gosh, this episode is really making me feel bad for Vegas. It is hot and he's not wearing gloves. Yeah, Vegas, I was thinking, if, if, if you want to prove that there's no poison, eat it yourself. The music is just really making, trying to make this a very lighthearted moment. Just ignore the fact that Pete is still handcuffed. Oh, Vegas, you're smiling. You're enjoying this so much, eh? Why are you walking like that? God damn it! God damn it! Don't show me that inhaler while I was trying to process what y'all did on the helicopter. Oh. I want to talk to the driver of the helicopter, though. How did you feel when all of that happened? 
Okay, 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 okay. I want to know everything. Is... <gasps> Yo, daddy. So that was episode 11 of Kin Porsche the series. Why am I still thinking about that helicopter? <laughs> okay, let me just get to the sweet moments before I get to honestly the main thing I'm thinking about right now in this episode. Okay, Kin and Porsche, y'all are out right now. Porsche, he's now no longer working as the bodyguard because he gets to live with Kin and you're basically married at this point, Kin and Porsche. You're basically married now. Okay, yeah, and then on that note, Porsche is now living with the main family, not as the bodyguard, and so is Porsche, which also meant that, oh, Porsche, he had to find out that Kim is also part of this family. You know, every time I see Porsche in pain, it puts me in pain. So I don't really know where else the Kim Shay storyline could turn, besides the fact that we still have Kim who's trying to dig up dirt on Porsche and Porsche's parents who I guess has some sort of relationship with his dad, Mr. Korn. So I don't know, maybe when it comes to the point that Kim will find out everything about Mr. Korn and then he'll tell everything to Porsche, something else could happen. And now, going on to, honestly, the main show of this episode, Vegas and Pete. Obviously, we're not going to excuse everything that Vegas did in this episode. But then again... What this episode did show us was another side of Vegas, and that's how he is with his dad. And that sort of became like a turning point as to how him and Pete got to open up to each other and find like some common ground. It was just something that it felt softer between the two of them now towards the end. I say softer but based on the preview for the next episode it's not gonna be soft for them at all. <laughs> so what did you guys think of this episode? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. But that's gonna be it for this video. If you guys enjoyed it please give it a big thumbs up. All my social media links will be in the description box below. Subscribe to my channel and turn on the bell I'll post notifications so that you'll be notified whenever I post a new video. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video whenever I could possibly make one. Bye.